All right, this is the second one from the T4 practice assessment. And so in order to get uh, at this one, let's uh, take a look at a couple things. So one thing that I notice is my midline is right here at negative 5. So I know it's going to be uh, negative 5. And then if I look at my offset in both directions, it looks like it's by 3. So it's off by 3. So it's going to be uh, plus 3. It's starting at the midline going up. So that's a positive sign. So it's sine. And so notice I got this from the midline. And I got this one from the, um, the offset from the midline, that amplitude. And so now let me think about the rest of it. Uh, I'm going to do a little bit of erasing. And so uh, this point right here tells me about <clears throat> the shift. Notice it's back pi over 6. So I'm going to make this an uh, x plus pi over 6. And I just have to know the stretch, how, how long it's been stretched. So if I look from here to here, that's a 35 pi over 6. And this is a negative pi over 6. So I could go minus it. But if I want to know how far apart they are, uh, I'm just going to add that pi over 6, minus a negative pi over 6. Um, and that would be 36 pi over 6, which is uh, 6 pi. So my period, then, is 6 pi. So if I want to know my multiplier, I take the standard period and divide it by that. I want to know how many times 6 pi goes into 2 pi, and it goes in there a third. So that means my multiplier for here is 1 third. And there is my equation.